413, we're on the road. Yes. We're gonna pick up our Wild horse. Wild horse. Her name is Jessica. And then once we pick Jessica up, we're gonna go pick up the Mustang. Yeah. For the makeover. Exactly. Yeah, where exactly are we headed? Luna Villa. I'm saying that right. That's how it's U N A D I L L A. And what country is that in? I mean, state? Georgia. It's down south. It's in Georgia still? Yeah, it's straight down 75. Good morning, Jessica. Oh, are you videotaping me this early in the morning? Yeah, welcome to um, Mustang Makeover. <laughs> Thank you. Right now, there are too many wild horses out on the land. Mm -hmm. They're they're overrunning the land a little bit. <laughs> so, BLM, the Bureau of Land Management, got a governing body. Um, has to remove a certain number of horses for that pro for for that property to be able to sustain the environment with the wild horses and all the other inhabitants. So they came up with an idea instead of sending all these horses off to slaughter like they used to do. Um, the extreme Mustang makeover helps. These horses find good homes. It, it offers enough incentive that the trainers want to do it. So you get the public is able to have access to green broke to at least horses that have been handled at a reasonable price. And, all, and the thing about the Mustangs are they're very intelligent, very smart. So they're different than a domesticated horse. What what is the incentive incentive to a trainer like you? Well, it shows off your training skills. It, there's a little bit of money, but it, it's mainly fun to say that you helped tame a wild horse. Because they are all auctioned off um, in October. So you actually have them for a grand total of what? How many Four days? Months, 120 days. At the end of 120 days, there's a competition, yeah. right? Yes. And what, what does that competition consist of? There are three phases of it. You have like an in hand where you show how the horse handles on the ground um, and then they also judge the horse's condition like its weight, its coat. Um, and then there is a riding section where there are certain movements that you have to perform and the horse is judged. And then if the top 10 horses are called back and you do a four minute freestyle to show everything you've got basically. Um, and that's the real entertaining part is to be able to see these horses were untouched and wild and after three months, four months, they can do amazing things. I think it's a good program because it's a way to try to help. It benefits everyone. <laughs>